Hello and happy Monday. This is Rochelle with ConfidentDreaming.com, your Disney life coach and energy alchemist here today with your magical Monday message. And today's message is you are the miracle. I thought Encanto would take three weeks and instead bonus week four, you are the miracle because I didn't talk about Mirabelle, the, the one who brought the family together, the one who helps them shine, whose gift is to see the best and bring out the best in others but her family doesn't see it because she doesn't have some supernatural gift like superhuman strength or the ability to just make a flower or heal somebody with food. They think she's not special. In the opening song, she talks about, I'm part of this family and they're amazing. So, and it's like left dot, dot, dot. Basically, she's trying to convince herself that she's amazing too, just because she's part of this family. She's brought up to believe that she doesn't have a special gift. <clears throat> but she still loves her family, like a lot. Um, Abuela is, I guess you could say the antagonist. I won't say like, you know, traditional Disney has evil queens. Um, she's not like that. Uh, she's somebody who's scared for her family. Um, the reason that the miracle started was for her sacrifice and the sacrifice of her husband. And she loses sight of that. She's all about working to earn the miracle. She says that in the opening song. She's about, um, yeah, you've got to prove it. You've got to work. You are your, you are the miracle. So you have to work for it and keep it going. But in the end, Mirabelle helps her see that the family themselves is the miracle. The love they had is what made the magic happen. And it's not about what they can do. It's just they are who they are, and that is a miracle in and of itself. It is called the miracle of life for a reason. It's so um, intricate <laughs> how we get pregnant and bring a life into this world, and it is truly a miracle. So each one of us, just by being here, is a miracle. We don't have to have special gifts. We don't have to have superhuman powers, and we're also not meant to to work to prove ourselves. We are special. We truly are special for who we are. And we do have natural gifts to bring to the world. And um, usually, as Maribel says in the final fight between her and Abuela, she says, I will never be good enough for you, no matter how much I try. And she goes on to say, uh, to defend her sisters, that um, Isabel will never be perfect enough. And Louisa will never be strong enough, that none of them are good enough for Abuela. And that's because none of them felt valued for who they were. They felt valued for their gifts and what they could bring to the world, but they didn't find value in who they were. And that was Mirabelle's gift, was to help them see who they were and that they didn't have to be perfect and that they didn't have to just go, go, go all the time. That as we discussed with Louisa's, that it's okay to take a break. What could you allow room for in your life to bring more joy? Or that, Isabel, that perfect isn't perfect, right? Do what you feel in the moment. Get lost in creativity. And with Bruno, they were scared instead of curious. So if you value somebody for who they are and not what they bring, you or when you value yourself for who you are and not what you bring to the table, you learn to value others just for who they are. Be curious and get to know them. Um, Mirabel just kept saying, all I need is a chance. She wanted to fix the miracle. She almost prophesied that it was going to break and it did. The house crumbled and, um, she wanted a chance, but Abuela didn't believe in that and didn't believe in her power of being able to save the family because she didn't have some outward gift. And it took Mirabel believing in herself to do it anyways, to keep going. And it did result in a big fight and the house broke and the family felt broken they were able to rebuild with a stronger foundation because of it. In it, they say, stars don't shine, they burn from the final word, from the final song, the miracle is you. And that is what Mirabelle does. She helps everybody, well, she helps them shine, but to burn, to keep the miracle burning, Mirabelle is able to basically save her whole family. And it's, it's such an underrated gift people have. Um, you know, I've been in and out of the food service industry most of my adult life, and many people look down on service, like all we do is deliver food. 
but a good one, they are serving others. They make people feel welcome. They make people um, feel at home, seen, valued, heard for whether it be the three minutes at Starbucks or the hour at a restaurant. Think about the, some of the times you've had an amazing experience. That person has a gift. They make you feel seen. Um, yeah, <laughs> I guess that's it. If you, if you don't feel seen, if you are looking for more in your life or change, you know, Maribel says, all I need is change. All I need is a chance. If you're ready to see the world for what it could be, I invite you to my program. It starts this Friday. I have some spots left. It is called The Gift of Change. I'll try to remember to post a link. Or if you're on my email list, you will have gotten the link. The Gift of Change project is a gift of coaching for me to you. I'm gifting 30 hours, so 30 different conversations to people looking for change in their life. If you haven't noticed around here, we've gone through... I guess a branding change, right? The colors, the logo, everything to embody more of who I am and what I bring. Because like Mirabelle, I can see the best in you and help you bring that forward. So I hope you have a wonderful day and I will talk to you soon. Bye.